All right, so we're doing blood vessels of the arm. All right, so we begin here, and being that we are superior to the clavicle, this little piece becomes our subclavian artery. Then it changes names and becomes the axillary artery. And when it gets to, you know, somewhere approximately here under the arm, it's gonna change its name from axillary to brachial. And, and the brachial is intertwined with all this yellow stuff, which is the, the nerves of the arm, okay? And I'm gonna turn this for a minute, and you can see that deep inside there, there's a branch that comes off and goes deep that would be uh, the beginning of the deep brachial. Huh? Then the brachial continues, okay? And then there is a split here. Now it's gonna be our ulna collateral branch coming off, and then the brachial continues to right about here. And you know, you can take a nice pulse here. This is a nice pulse point, the brachial pulse, but you also, this is where you use your blood pressure cuff wrapped around and you put your stethoscope here. This is where you monitor um, blood pressure. The brachial then is going to continue and it's going to split into one, two, three branches. This runs along the thumb, that's the radial artery, down the center into osseous artery, and along the pinky side, the ulna artery. They continue down and then they coalesce and come together into a palmar arch. And then coming off of the palmar arch are the digital arteries going to the fingers.